welcome back to my channel. I hope you're all doing well and keeping safe. Today I'm joined with Els and we are going to be making our favourite vegan chocolate chip cookies. So if you would like to see how we bake those, then please keep watching. Today we are actually going to be using the cookie baking set from a company called Cookhouse Bakes. This is my mum's company, so make sure to go follow the account on Instagram and check out what new products she's got coming. But right now we have the cookie baking set. All the ingredients in here are already measured out and ready, so it's gonna be super easy for us non-bakers to create them. So this is inside of the cookie baking set as you can see all the ingredients are ready and bagged and these are all perfectly measured out so you can get the best cookies and they can taste absolutely delicious. There also is an instructions sheet so don't worry if you don't know how to make them we've got you covered. The instructions are in there. Hello vegan slash non-vegan cookie eaters. Right so the cocoa powder, the baking powder, the flour and a little bit of salt is actually already in this pack so um it's yeah already done for you sweet and easy do you know what i mean cool so our oven is already preheated it's ready to go i feel like i'm on a cooking program like here's one i prepared earlier yeah nice shots yeah 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 yeah, yeah nice shots yeah right so all you're gonna need is a big mixing bowl obviously something to mix the mixture with your tray for the cookies to go on either with grease proof paper or you can use flour just to make sure the cookies don't stick to your tray because that would be so upsetting if you'd spent all that time and they didn't come off the tray and then also a cup just to measure out your milk and butter and yeah if you've got all of that you're good to go we are creating vegan ones today, so we're using flora butter and oat milk, but like it says in the instructions, you can use whatever you have at home, whatever you like to use, whether it's vegan or non-vegan, it's completely up to you. If else, you put the sugar in there. It was almost packaged too nice that you don't want to open it. I know. So if I can make these, anyone can make these, because I am absolutely pony when it comes to baking. Oh! Nice dog. Utterly, bottily, utter. <laughs> Can I do it? Yep, just mix it into this all kind of like a smooth creamed paste with the sugar and butter. If you've ever done baking before, you kind of know the consistency we're looking for, but if not, we will show you after it's done. Now that the butter and sugar into a nice paste, we're gonna add the cute little bottle of vanilla essence, just to make the cookies taste really scrumptious. Right, if you mix that together, a please. Next is the flour. Like we said, the flour has the cocoa powder, the baking powder and the salt already mixed in. So it's literally just so easy. It's so convenient having these sets, especially if you're, you know, not an experienced baker like us. It just makes the whole experience a bit more fun, a bit more enjoyable and just easier. It means you get to eat your cookies quicker as well, so it's a win-win, really. All right, are you ready for the flour? Okay, be gentle, hun, because it goes everywhere. Oh, sugar. Gentle, hun, gentle. I am being gentle. Oh, fuck. Oi, I just realised after we filmed this year, we can actually eat these, legs. Yeah. We recently ran out of our batch of chocolate chip cookies and I've been craving them ever since, so hence why we're filming this today, because we're big pieces. Big pieces. Right. Look, look what you've done. You've got it all I over the gaff as well. Done anything. What should I do? Just stand there and look pretty, really. We're now going to add in a tablespoon of oat milk, but like I said at the beginning, you can use any milk of your choice, but we always have used oat and it seems to taste pretty good, so. Oh, yeah. Good. Good. If your mixture does get a bit too runny, like if you've possibly added too much milk in or yeah, if you've just added too much milk in, then you can add some flour on top just to really solidify the mixture so it's not too runny and that you can actually shape it into balls. A little baking hack for you there, guys. Leave a like on this video if you want Pops to do some more baking stuff. Oh, yeah. This company, Cookhouse Bakes, they're not just doing the cookies now. They're bringing out brownies. They're bringing out, what else are they bringing out? Scones, vegan scones for right. afternoon tea. Oh. Basically, all different products that you can try and make at home 
in a really easy way. Step by step, learn to bake with Pop and Ells. Yeah, have you noticed how she's done nothing this whole video? <laughs> Just like that. Wah, 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 wah. Oh, perfect pan. These sets make eight to 12 cookies. We're probably gonna do eight. So six. Cause we like to make cookies. So what you're gonna wanna do is grab a good amount like Elle's did, roll it in your hands. I like to make mine like round. <laughs> Sorry, my hands are so grim. Yeah, that is just... This is just from me mixing. Don't be afraid to get your hands dirty. Just whack it in, give it a roll. There we go, gosh. Great British Bake Off, eat your heart out. I mean, you could whack some of these up, yeah? Got some mates coming round, got some family members coming round. Get a pack of these, whack them together. Someone comes round, oh, do you want a cookie, mate? Yeah, yeah, I'll have a cookie. Oh, these are ledge. Where'd you get these from? My ovens are I got them, mate. Because I made them. Do you know what I mean? Show off in front of your pals. It's all good. The good thing about baking these cookies is they only take 10 minutes to bake. So if you're impatient like me and Elliot and you just want to eat cookies, they don't take long in the oven. So you're welcome. Ta-da! Right, so now you want to move this bowl out of the way, yeah? Get your tray. And then you've got this pack here. And you just want to press them in nice and evenly. These are dark chocolate buttons. These are what you get within the pack. But if you want to be experimental or if you prefer a different chocolate, like if you want to put Terry's chocolate orange in. Or you Ooh, wanna, yes. Now you're hitting them yeah. with the recommendos. Or you want to put some white chocolate in, then it's completely up to you. This, this is why this is such a good set because you can literally bespoke your cookies to however you like them. We're just giving you the basics to create them. Why yeah. do you poke them like yeah, shark tooth? What are you doing Look there? Look at mine, they're all flat. They're gonna ooze out when they bake. Yours, that's not cute. No. Mm. <laughs> one for the cookie, one for Elliot. One for the cookie, one for Elliot. So they look like fucking oh. hell. See that? <laughs> you lost. We almost lost all eight. That's what we're looking like. We look all right, yeah. And now they're going in the oven. Bye. Okay, six minutes counting. Oh my boy, they look so good. They do, don't they? They smell ledge as well. And the cookies are ready. They look ledge. Oh, they look chef's kiss. Get your eyes on these. Oh, flip it. What out. did I just say? <laughs> we almost lost. Look at that. Ooh. Oi. Mm. Obviously, we have to leave them to cool for a little bit before we eat them. Just remember that because you could burn yourself. Oh, they smell ledge, man. They look absolutely incredible. I'm so proud of us. I'm so impressed. High five. Bosh. It just goes to show how easy they are to make using the Cookhouse Bake set. That's all I can say. I'm going to leave that there for you. Thank you guys for watching this video and baking with us. I do hope you enjoyed watching us create some ledge cookies. These gorgeous works of art in front of us. We're going to let them cool for a little bit and then probably dig in, watch a movie later. Maybe have them Enjoy. with some ice cream. Oh, yes. But we do hope you enjoyed this video. If you would like to create a set of cookies like this, then follow Cookhouse Bakes, message them, and get what? yourself a cookie set ASAP. On Instagram. Message Cookhouse Bakes on Instagram if you want to get your hands on this set. Nice and easy. So thank you guys for watching. I do hope you enjoyed. If you did, please don't forget to give this video a big thumbs up. Don't forget to subscribe. Hit that post notification bell. And until then, we will see you in the next one. Bye, guys. Bye.